yo what's good people welcome back to another video i hope you're good and well guys i prepared a vlog for you today and and this vlog is going to bista village now the ones who are there who don't know what bista village is and where it is and how to get there i'll share all the information with you in this video now just before we do that guys could you please hit that subscribe button smash that like button and let's all grow this channel together and let's take it to the next level and yeah guys so i hope you'll enjoy the video so i'll be sharing with you all the details as i said and go through whether it was a hit or a miss I want to briefly point out one thing and that is when you do go to village you're probably gonna see that there is a like a queuing system going on like a online queuing system and the way it works is you scan a code like a QR code and then you're put into a online queue and when your turn comes up it will send you a text as you see the one right here and um, you'll basically have like five minutes or so to go back to that store and just shop if you miss you don't go there in five minutes you're gonna be put back into the queue and it just takes forever and ever. I highly suggest that as you get to Bissy Village, just uh, get your phone out, scan where you really wanna go. Like for example, if you wanna go Prada, Chivanchi, all these big brands, then I highly suggest that you should scan first as you get there. So my first purchase at Bista Village was this nice Calvin Klein top. I thought it was a vibe, it looked nice. And yeah, it was only like 32 pounds, 33 pounds on the outlet price. I thought, yeah, it's a mascot, so I just got it. Before going to Bista Village, guys, I was looking for a pair of loafers in my local high street, and I just couldn't find anything, uh, you know, to my liking, or the quality wasn't there. And I really didn't mind spending a little bit of money on uh, on Todd's. So I thought, you know, as I'm going to Bista Village, I might just check out Todd's as well. And I did find these nice pair of loafers, but they didn't have my size. So I was a little bit gutted, but you know what, we just got to move on. Maybe there's something better for me. Every time I came to Bista Village, I always slept on Sandra. I always looked away never really you know went inside the shop i thought okay it just looks quite dead <laughs> i'll be honest I, I didn't really like it i thought oh, i don't know what they have but this time i went inside there because i really couldn't find anything for myself for me it was a miss this time i couldn't find anything in Bista village so i went to sandro's and this lovely jumper was there of casper the ghost and it looked very nice so i thought you know what let me try it on uh, when it comes to trying it on as I went into the fitting room, the size was just not good. Like, they didn't have any other size. I wanted medium um, because this was a small that I tried on and it was just quite tight. They only had like a large or extra large. And I didn't want to look, I didn't want to have like a too much of a baggy look or, you know, I just wanted something that was comfortable. I dream this, this size just didn't fit me, so I had to, you know, drop it down. Now moving on to the try on guys, so the first one I'm going to be trying out is the Tommy Hilfiger top. 
this uh, this was 25 pounds at the outlet price and uh, yeah i really like this one i uh, never got a tommy hilfiger top in this color before it's always been white gray or a mixture of white and black and this is the first time i got it in full black and i really like it it's uh, it sits very well onto onto me and the fitting is very good as well the material quality is amazing it's soft to the touch and overall it's just amazing basically next one we have the calvin klein top guys and this was my first purchase from bista village and uh, in terms of the fitting i have noticed a difference between this and the tommy Hilfiger top and that is like around the arms of uh, around my arms i think the material just hogs onto it a little bit more it doesn't really provide me that extra room that the tommy hilfiger does but it is still comfortable to wear and i do see myself wearing this a lot in the fall winter season and uh, the other difference is it's the price difference so this is about 32 33 pounds whereas the other one is 25 pounds so it's about you know seven eight pounds difference but yeah these are the two tops Moving on to the travel information. Now, I'll just let you know, I live in London. So for me to get to Oxford, basically Vista Village is to go by train or even I can take a car, but I took a train and it was much easier for me to get there. It only takes about 45 minutes. And you can have a book your tickets online from Chilton Railways, which is the train that goes there. Or you can go uh, to the station, Marylebone Station in London and get your tickets on the counter like I did. And the other way is to go there by a car, which will take you roughly about just under two hours to get there. But the benefit of a car is that you got your own safety, your own privacy, your own comfort of traveling. And you can just go there anytime you want to go there and come back, not having to worry about missing trains or train delays or anything like that. Yeah, so you, there are many different ways you can get there. It depends on where you live as well and how cheap it is or you know the prices do vary and also off peak and on peak times the prices kind of vary as well and in the description below i will leave the link for the website you can buy your tickets from if you're planning to go there and you don't want to go get your tickets in the station and you want to book online uh, that's only if you haven't been there before but yeah uh, that's how you can get there right guys that's all for today i hope you'll enjoy the video if you did please smash that like button Please subscribe, turn the notification bell on as well, show your support, I would really appreciate if you do. I want you all to be part of the success on this channel and be part of this amazing journey. But yeah guys, that's all for me today and as always, have a nice day and peace.